I be so sick of you niggas, y'all can't just think me. I be so bold myself, can you come and fuck me? I feel so ordinary, so make you around me. We're here. We made it to go short, probably maybe about two hours ago. But we just walking around. It ain't that late. We just but we just walking around just checking out certain places. We couldn't get in the pool because the pool closed at nine. So we got here around about 845. Because I left out a little late. But um the pool up back up again tomorrow morning. So we will probably get in the pool tomorrow after breakfast and then we're gonna head to the beach and check out the beach tomorrow if I can get in the beach because they doing something at the beach and they got some of the clothes and then a park and then the parking is just terrible so come on Paris so now we're gonna head to the room so we can shower but we did just walk to the beach though but the part that we walked to it was um private property trespassing so come on we couldn't do it <laughs> but we're gonna go home and shower because we had long down the road it been hot no. yes we had some air but it's oh the lightning but it been hot and yeah all right y'all so me and Lele, we just made it back in we just took a shower i just blew up a few ooh, a, ooh, a few balloons and um Tomorrow, we're gonna go to the pool in the morning and then we're gonna go to the beach, put on our beach wear and go to the beach tomorrow. Right now, it's after midnight. Today is Lele's birthday. She just turned seven years old. So, yeah. Hey, Lele. Alright y'all, so Alright y'all, so this is what I'm wearing to the beach. We're gonna head out to the beach. So yeah. Period. And then they go Lele. She wearing. So yeah. Alright so we made it to the pool. They have like like a half of the pool. I mean, we made it to the beach. But they had half of it like closed because of the hangout festival. Yeah, y'all he look like she's very excited. I'm excited too, y'all. Very excited. We're here. I just waves. I see I see some waves. Oh crap, lady, we left the floaties. Well, I'm scared to get in the water. Yeah, y'all, we're here. We just got back from the beach and we had hopped in a pool for like a few minutes now we're gonna find some more activity to do y'all i apologize that i'm not really vlogging it's like i was at the beach and i was just kind of relaxing i did take some pictures of course and some videos of let me of course but it's like this is my first time out of the city in Hi. years so no it's not mine so i'm just trying to enjoy our time while we're here because we leave tomorrow and we were just here for like a few days. So, yeah, now we're gonna go find some more activities to do. We're going to different places, come on. So now we might go get, um, what you call it? Having some ice cream. We might go get some ice cream and stuff like that. 
but we probably because we got we're gonna have dinner later so as of right now we just you know doing some certain activities i'm gonna go check out one of the water parks and see what's that about um Yeah, because I see what, what all they do at the water park. But, um. Maybe you have maybe like a green dropout, like, like you slide down. It I goes don't know. super fast. I don't know. It's all the way. Then that, that, that's what I mean. I got half of the beach club. So they, you see that right there? They building for the hangout festival. Uh, I ain't see it right. I, I can't talk. But they uh, got that for um, the little hangout they having this week. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Water bill. <laughs> y'all so i'm gonna put this in the clip real quick i had to run in there because i ended the video as i had just mentioned in the video that i was gonna show y'all a quick souvenir and then i'm gonna put some pictures up there as well so this is the bag that comes with it and it's a you know surf style you know it's really nice you take it to the beach and i end up paying extra for another bag because i wanted another bag and um this is my shirt. I just got a shirt. Feel me? I just got me a shirt. The bag came with it. Um, and one other bag, so you know. Because I got one leather that one. And this bag, this is a leather shirt. I was looking for me a tie-dye, but I, I wanted it this tie-dye, but I didn't have it in my size. And I was a little mad about it, but this is hers here. Um, then we have um, um, Souvenir City Gift Shop. This is a really cute bag. And I got me like a little cup holder thingy for like cold drinks. Um, got me a matching, I mean a shot gat, a shot glass in purple as well like this because you know purple is my favorite color and orange is the second favorite color and I kind of like pink a little bit. I got this uh, picture frame and this is glass so I'm going to blow up one of our pictures we took together or a few pictures in, or put a, like a collage of all of them and put them all in here. So, yeah. Yeah, that's about it. And then I put a picture. Well, Layla got Layla got the same thing I got. Plus, she wanted her own little shot glass. And she had got a rainbow shot glass. And then we bought my mom a souvenir. We got her an LSU cup and a Gulf Shore shot glass. But hers is rainbow. And Layla got it. She drinking out of it. And it's rainbow as well. So, yeah. We have a good time with y'all, but so I just wanted to put that in there real quick. So, what up, y'all? So, 
This my excuse my candle. Hold on. Actually, I'm gonna put you on top of my candle. Actually. Mm -hmm. All right, what are y'all? So now we're me and Lele are finally home we got home around 5 46 in the morning because I left out at like 12 40 something something like that so we're finally home took a shower washed our hair now I just gotta unpack I don't know if y'all really care what to watch me unpack so yeah I'm not gonna really record unpacking but my baby enjoyed her trip. I enjoyed my trip. It was really for her birthday, her seventh birthday. Make sure y'all come in and blow. Tell her happy late birthday. She been asking to go to the beach. And mommy finally made it happen with no hesitation, no excuses. All I did, you know, save the money and we got there. Even though I don't have a car, but we got there. I drove there and back. So nonstop four hours. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's on Facebook, but yeah, she enjoyed herself. I'm happy she did. We did um, bumper cars. We did um, bump boaters. Uh, well, you know when you draw the boat on water and you know bump, you know bump each other. Um, we ate good there. We ate Lambert's Cafe, which I thought it. Would, I would have remember what it tastes like because I went there and I was a little girl. And now that I'm 23 years old. And I kind of forgot what it tastes like, but it was actually good. They threw rolls at us. Like, now I do remember that part that they throw roll like bread at you. But, you know, it was really good. Even though she was tired the second day there, we had a long day. We got in the pool and walked the beach to build a sand council. We went shopping, got some souvenirs. Um, I also got to show y'all a few souvenirs that we got from the beach. So that was her first time there. This is probably like my second time going there, but we're not gonna count when I was a little girl, okay? This is my first time going as a grown up, period. So. So, and then, you know, my uh, footage was terrible because I said I was gonna vlog it, but I didn't too much vlog because it's like, I was just happy to just get up out of my city and just, let it all sink in that I wasn't at home. I got here by myself. Didn't nobody help me get here. All me, like just me and her. So had a good time. And I just want us to enjoy her birthday together. You know, just feel good to get out the house, get out the city. Cause you know, when I do get out the city, I'll probably go. No, never mind. I'm gonna lie. I'm gonna try to make up a lie. <laughs> I don't because I've been saying. My city, I drive probably when I work in a plant, I won't probably in my city. I'd be in like somebody else's city. But I still be in Alabama area, period. I was in but I was they probably like thirty minutes away. You feel me? But there's like a four hour drive, so I was really out out of the city. So it feels good. We seen the water. Um uh, we collected some shells, of course. And then we went to the beach just to sit there, you know, just sit there when the um, sun went down and it was a little windy and you see the other people and the kids out there in the ocean and the wave. Baby, the water was cold, period. Ain't no, period. But we didn't get in the water. We just walked like towards the water, but I wasn't planning on like swimming in the water and like that. So we did most of that like in the pool, stuff like that. But it was really good. Yeah, I enjoyed myself. I feel really good. I have, it opened up my mind a little bit, like, I see now I, I like to travel and I'm gonna wanna travel now. So it's like now it's so much that I wanna do. I really it's like I wanna travel and just do stuff now. I see it feels good to be away from home and out just away from your city, just seeing the same old stuff and experience new things there. We did a lot of stuff there. I was able to see stuff like I was excited like I was a kid, you feel me? So, yeah, it was really, really, really exciting to see. So, I can go on and on about this, y'all. Like, all I went was to the beach. And I'm so excited. Like, I done went to move LA or something. But to me, it don't take too much to make me happy. It's just knowing that I'm just always at home. Like, 
homework, homework, homework. And I was just able to have me a long vacation. So, yeah. I enjoyed it. <sighs> so now, I'm going to finish unpacking and me allow that finger for bed. I was going to cook something because we, I mean, oh yeah, we went and got some ice cream too, y'all. Um, yeah. It was really good. We may we may actually go to the beach maybe once a year for now. I don't know. So don't 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 hang that up my head. But I may take another trip somewhere this year. You never know. Cause I see now that trip was a start for me. It really was. It was a start for me. It was a really start for me. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. That's all over the place and you know a little short. So I had to come to the end and talk to make it a little bit longer. Thank you guys so much for riding with me, watching my videos, subscribing to my channel. Shout out to all my new supporters. If you are subscribed to the channel, you are not part of the tweet babes, you know, tweet little gang, you know, that TLG. So I'm gonna call y'all both tweet little gang, TLG, tweet babes, whatever it is, that's what we're gonna call y'all. And thank y'all also so much. Like I said, for showing love, showing me your feedback, you know, just working and bearing with me and my content. So, I, I sat down on the beach and I thought about what I want to do now. And this year, I think I know what I want to do. So, y'all stay tuned. Follow me on this journey. I see now I was a little YouTube blockage, life blockage, you know, stuff like that. So, it's like now that... I was able to just sit and just think about what I want to do. And I think, 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 I know what I want to do. I think I'm going to show what I want to do. So, y'all just stay tuned and watch me on the dream. Because hopefully, praying to God, I know my life can change in less than probably like 12 months, maybe less than a year. I just got to be determined to do it. And shout out to y'all because this is for y'all as well motivation of lifting each other women and men your life can change in a month from now three months from now six months from now 12 months from now a year from now weeks from now you just gotta be determined to do it and put the work towards it and the dedication period there's no excuse there's no reason and just stop letting people put stuff in your head because I'm the type of person I let a lot of people put stuff in my head stuff just going based off my own opinion my own advice and just taking a risk and y'all like I said I only went to the beach and this is how I'm thinking this that's all it takes just to get away from your city go somewhere peace and quiet turn your phones off no social media no nothing just sit and think and the beach is one of the places to sit and think like it's so calm it's so soothing just not when it's hot Baby, when it's hot, no. Sand hot. It's hot. You swim. The world is gold, yeah. But <laughs> you over there thinking about, baby, I'm hot. I'm trying to relax. So that's why I said we went back to the beach when the sun went down. And, you know, we just sat, chill. But, yeah, thank y'all and subscribe to my channel. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.